Welcome to a new video here at the workshop, my name is Ipmalik. Today we will look at how to reset a forgotten password in Windows 11, Windows 10 and Windows 8. It's actually a big problem when you can't open your computer. You are trying to remember your password, but it doesn't work. You can reset your password and come up with a new one, but you didn't create a password reset flash drive. Do not worry, look carefully, repeat exactly after me, step by step, and we will succeed. And so, in order to reset the password, we need to open a command prompt, and first I will show you four ways to open a command prompt. Method number one. On your keyboard, press and hold the shift key. And then click, here. And restart your computer. The automatic system restore program opens. Click, troubleshoot. Then, advanced options. Now click, command prompt. This was the first way to open a command prompt. Depending on your operating system configuration, the program may ask you for your password before opening a command prompt. In this case, I suggest opening the command prompt in another way. For those who have found the first method to work, you can skip the second, third and fourth methods and go straight to the steps in the command prompt. Method number two. If, after turning on the computer, Windows freezes on its logo, press the reset button on the system unit to force restart the PC or hold the power button until the computer turns off. After a few seconds turn the PC back on. When the Windows logo first appears, immediately press the reset button again or force shut down the computer. On the laptop, use the power button to force shut down. Do this two or three times until a white font appears on the screen. This is loading the system recovery program. No problems were found during the automatic recovery and diagnostics of the system. And now you need to click advanced settings. The main menu of the program has opened, press troubleshoot. And then click, here. This was the second way to open a command prompt. Method number 3. To do this, connect the installation USB flash drive Windows 8, 10 or Windows 11 to the PC, turn on your PC and call the boot menu. To do this, immediately after the start of the reboot, Constantly press the key on your keyboard to call the boot menu. I have this key, F9. You may have, F8, F9, F11, F12, or some other key. You can see how to call the boot menu in my other video, the link is in the description for this video. Find your bootable USB flash drive in the boot menu, press, enter. If you have connected a USB flash drive Windows 11, 10 or Windows 8, wait for the Windows installation menu to open but we will not install anything, click, next. Here we click, repair your computer. The main menu of the program has opened, press troubleshoot. And then click, here. How to open command prompt. Method number 4. This method is similar to method number 3. Connect a bootable Windows USB flash drive to your computer, Open the boot menu and boot your computer from this USB flash drive. The installation menu has opened and now press on your keyboard, Shift, F10, at the same time. A command prompt has opened. Write, Notepad, Press, Enter. A notepad window has opened, now click, File, then, Open, and in that window, click, This PC. Here we see several disks and we need to find the disk where Windows is located. My Windows is located on the partition marked with the letter E, my local drive C is reserved by the system. I select the local drive E and we see the files of the Windows operating system. You can also find the Windows disk, then open it. There you should see a program files folder, 
a users folder, and so on. You may have a completely different letter on your local drive with the Windows operating system. Please remember your letter with the Windows drive. We close this window. Close notepad. And now we need to write several commands to reset the password in the command prompt. Move. Space. I write the letter E, but you must write your own letter, which is assigned to your local Windows drive, then colon, slash, Windows, slash, System32, slash, Utilman, dot, exe, space, I write the letter again, E, but you must write your own letter, which is assigned to your local Windows drive, colon, slash, Windows, slash, System32, slash, Utilman2, dot, exe, press, enter, now write, copy, space, I write the letter E, but you must write your own letter, which is assigned to your local Windows drive, then colon, slash, Windows, slash, System32, slash, CMD, dot, exe, space, I write the letter again, E, but you must write your own letter, which is assigned to your local Windows drive, colon, slash, Windows, slash, System32, slash, Utilman, dot, exe, press, enter, now write, Wuputal, space, reboot, press, enter, and the computer will restart. My computer has rebooted, I hope everything went well for you, and now you need to click on this button. The command line has opened. Here write the command, net, space, user, press, enter. Here we need to find the name of our account, my name, Ip Malik. Now we will write the following command, net, space, user, space, I write my account name, Ip Malik. You write your name, space, put a sign, asterisk, press, enter, press, enter, press, enter again. Now we have removed the password, instead of the password we have set an empty space, and this has completed the password reset process. But I have to tell you one more addition to this process. If your account name is two or more words, that's a problem. In this case, try to write all these few words without a space, for example, if the name is John Smith, write, John Smith. Or try putting such a name in quotation marks, try several options, and this should solve the problem. To exit a command prompt, write, exit, and press, enter. Now you do not need to enter a password, and to enter Windows, just click, here. And so, we reset the forgotten password, we were able to enter Windows, but now our computers are left without protection. And for everyone who wants to set a new password, I will show you how to do it right. Click the button, Start. Then, Settings. Here click, Accounts. Sign in Options. Then click, Password. And in this window, click, Add. Now you need to come up with a new password and write it here. 
write the password again. Now password hint. Next. New password set. Click, finish. Now my computer is protected and I hope that what I just said could help you. And if you found it useful, please share my video with anyone. Write me a comment, I will answer all your questions and try to help you. Thank you very much for watching my video. Good luck.